Hip hop, people, places, and things. There was a time in hip hop culture before the rapper. So I'm gonna pose the question, why did vinyl from pop, rock, jazz, blues, funk, disco, R&B, alternative, Latin, become such an important ingredient to hip hop? With the creation of the DJ techniques, that gave birth to the rapper. And you will witness this at the show. And I first seen him DJing and creating the quick mix theory. And it's been pretty exciting. The show that he has now, he now has big screens. He now has LEDs. He now has cameras that they can show you his hands on the turntable. He has reinvented himself time and time again. And I've witnessed this over the years. Well, I'm currently having the pleasure to watch Flash build this show and put this show together so he can deliver an amazing presentation uh, to the world. You know, again, 2017, going into 2018, um, this is going to be something that everybody across the country, every country across the world is going to be able to enjoy. With the use of today's multimedia technology, I'm going to be placing my fingertips on the vinyl for you to see cutting and scratching live on the screen. I'm also going to display some of my album covers from my collection. So we, the new show that we got now with the visuals is, you know, flashy sets have always involved the crowd a lot more than the usual DJs, but this is, this is a fully immersive experience. Here. We do promise to rock tonight. We do promise to rock you tonight. But before we go any further, I want to take this time to pay homage and respect some artists that did some very special things. Music, stay with me. time I saw Flash's new stage setup was at uh, the Barefoot Ball in Bryant Park in New York City and the crowd reaction just made me feel like this was a gift to the fans. Starting in the Bronx, talking about the forefathers of hip-hop and really elevating DJing as a craft that is important in the history of the story of rap, hip-hop, and music as we know it today. What could I possibly say? I mean, he is definitely the definition of what it is to be a legend. A legend, the hip hop, one of the greatest hip hop pioneers ever. And to bring it all the way back to New York City, a place like Madison Square Garden, this is, this is, this is massive. This is two decks, one mixer, one microphone, one man. He doesn't just play at the crowd, he plays for the crowd. I want to see those fans in here. Where's all my Bronx people? Where's all my New York people? Put your hands I've been saying this for such a long time, probably over a decade, since the first time I ever saw Grandmaster Flash live. If you haven't seen him up there, mastering the turntables, putting his hands on the records, controlling the dance floor, I believe you haven't seen a DJ. This new experience and the big screens up above showing you his hands live and in real time, that's how monumental it is to understanding Music, hip hop, DJing as we know it. I want to share this multi musical, multi genre origin of hip hop with you. See you at the show. Grandmaster. Out.